Hello, hello, this is Kaladoon, and welcome back to Let's Play Depths of Urkala. We are at the entrance to the Molten Mines, and, well, let's go. Got the amazing sword. Like, I, I am unbelievably happy about just the existence of this sword. We got some fire resist potions in case we fall into the lava down there. Look at that lava. Uh, ender pearls would probably be good to have, but honestly, I forgot them. And we do have the bucket of water too, so I think we're. In God damn it! Yep. Yep. Ah. Really, that didn't kill you? Oh wow! I'm genuinely surprised that that didn't kill it. I mean, there's a power two bow. Ha <laughs> ha! Take that, mutant mobs. Alright, I'm going to go up like here, because I have no idea how powerful those custom mobs are. So I'm going to be pretty cautious against them until I know what they can do. And nothing says caution. Like... I was about to blitz in, but then he showed up. Okay, so they take... Oh, wow. These guys are tanks. Okay. Light up. I see baby zombie. <laughs> okay, there's a spawner over there in that corner. Looks like just that corner. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Please, cause oh, there's individual spawn. Oh, okay. I so, so I see the wool. Wool is down there. That's good to know, cause that implies that the rest of this is just loot. Which don't get me wrong, I like loot, but at least lets me know what I can and cannot prioritize. I mean, if I was a good shot with an Ender Pearl, it would be tempting to just go grab that right now, but not what they have. Oh, efficiency three, fortune three. And protection too. Hey, that one again. Worn tunic. Nice. Good. Good callback. I'm. I was genuinely not. Why, well, hello, gas tier. Oh my god. I. Look at those support beams. I. I. Good job with this place so far. I'm. I'm really liking this dungeon. Oh. Here's witches. Okay. And blazes, of course. Okay. Blazes aren't too much of an issue. Again, I've got fire protection, five armor. So, it's more I just was trying to... Honestly, I, I was legitimately more worried about that witch. That, uh, there's skellies over there too, and there's creepers. Again, don't really care about the blazes too much. Oh my god, they're so tanky. It's like they don't they don't even hit hard, they're just so tank so tanky. Okay, let me rephrase that. The only worry about the blazes is them potentially knocking me off. Yeah. Ooh, and there's a chest over there. Let's go and pillar over. Or bridge over, not pillar. Okay, there's a gas spawner over there that I need uh, need to keep an eye on. Where'd you go? Are you just sniping me from beneath? Aren't you? Yep. Okay, I'm 
pretty sure cobble's gas proof, right? And so mossy cobble should be too. Crap, how deep is this? <laughs> Safety first. <laughs> Hoping that uh, maybe somewhere in here, here there'll be some iron also. I mean, it is a mine, so... Gosh, unless it's... Oh my god. No, that's... A blessing's not always benevolent, but that's a pretty benevolent blessing. Smite 4, looting 3. It's awesome. More emergency flames. Hot spade. I thought flame was only for, uh... Bows. I'll, I'll give it a shot. I'm curious now. Berserker's Brew. Oh my god. I am loving this loot. This is great. Oh, I don't know if I've announced it yet, but... So this actually works out great since I had decided to figure this out a few days ago. Yeah. Oh, wait, is that one? Okay. But uh, the next Let's Analyze is was actually going to be all about loot. So... Yeah, thanks for giving me more stuff to talk about. This is great. Oh, I triggered. That's a different place, Bonner, than before. Okay. Right, that's where I shot all the, the 50 billion skellies. Creeper. Was it multiple? There was at least... There was one creeper, at least. I can't remember if there were more than one. Okay, cool. Light it up. And... Oh crap, there's a creeper there. It's like, like I said, blazes, don't care, don't care about the blazes. I mean that, that armor's got, that fire protection 5 armor's got a long time to, it's, it's gonna last me a while. Okay, maybe I do care, maybe I do care, maybe I do care, I do care, I care. I very much care. So much caring. Oh god, and there's a guest spawner. Okay. Yeah, that probably didn't help. Both my uh, pants broke. Okay. I'm gonna chug the regular potion of strength, not the crazy berserkers brew. And I might as well switch to the uh, efficiency three pick. Good shot. Good. Uh, I was not expecting to get a hit from that far. Higher. I think there's still one more over there, but. Getting the spawners the important part. There's also definitely a creeper spawner downstairs, I think. Boop, there you go. Are you a baby one or a full one? You're a baby one. I don't really care for care about the baby ones, it's the full ones I like. Hey, like that guy, you you get to you get to live. You don't. Oh yeah, blessed sword is amazing. Goodbye, blaze spawners. Okay, let's fall back, heal up a bit, and repeat. No, 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 don't burn. No burning to death. Burning to death is bad. Okay. Yeah, it's not the fire. The fire do isn't doing anything, really. It's just the, uh, yeah, it's not the fire, it's everything else. It's just the fact that their hits actually do damage, and I, it's, 
it's so easy to forget that when you're fighting them, I think. I've got some good loot, though. Oh, come on! We're freaking snipers. Okay, this was the... I think this is the wrap, actual wrap to the wall? Ooh. Ooh, that's new and exciting. Did you drop iron? You did. Who's a good baby zombie? Oh my, oh, I'm down to ten arrows. That is that is bad, actually. That's very bad. Ugh. Okay, um... I'm gonna have these two out because Smite does nothing. You know, Smite is totally useless against the, uh, against blazes. Let's heal up a bit. It's actually, uh, what I want to do is get... Yeah, I'm just gonna pick these guys off now. Yeah, because I, I got their spawner already, right? I think I did. Alright, cool. Let's switch to the Blade of the Mines, just so that way I can have some extra HP in case of emergencies. Now, admittedly, when I'm actually moving, I want to be able to switch weapons, and now I want the Blessed Sword. Blessed Sword? Because Smite 4 just wrecks the undead, and I love it. Yes! Iron! Haha! -ha! Oh, man. This just made my day. And I'm gonna leave all these spawners for now. Yes! Oh man, that is sweet. And I'm gonna leave the lava too, just because it's giving a light source. Oh man. Yep, there's uh, it's iron all the way down. Awesome. It's also spawners all the way down, but still, you take what you can get. Alright, let's just go nuts. Anyway, uh, I'm probably going to spend a good... Oh, maybe I won't spend a good bit mining. And now I got, I got plenty of junk I can drop. that. Anyway, uh, you probably don't want to see this, so I'm going to cut, and I'll be back in a few minutes. Alright, so I went ahead and got about two stacks of iron out of there. Picked up, uh, there was in a chest a fully, you know, a full-use lucky pick, so that was awesome. A couple potions that I've stashed back at base, and check this out, I now have full iron. When I get the chance, I'm going to repair the Blessed Sword and play the Mines and Scorched Chest. Basically, I'm just going to repair everything once I get the chance. Uh, levels are actually the limiting factor at the moment. I also went ahead, ground for some more arrows. And there's an Unbreaking 2 bow back at base as well that I'm going to combine with the Ancient bow. But again, levels. So, um, hopefully that'll change. Whoa. The, my input just went crazy there. There we go. Okay, life's good now. But uh, hopefully that will all change. Anyway, we've got... Let's see. So it looks like there's a platform up there that we still need to get to. There is still, of course, the wall. Which I think it's this way we could go see the wall. Is that... There's some vantage point where I know I got to... Where I could see it off in the distance. Okay, I think the wool is... Right, yes, yes, yes. Yeah, it was over here next to the ghast. Yeah, I can see there's the fleecy box over there. And I almost walked straight off that. Okay. Pay attention, Ian. You got this. Oh, by the way, my name's Ian. Um, I think I, like, almost said it in a video earlier, but didn't. I don't know, I, like, stopped myself, but, eh, I really don't care that much. But, 
Because right now, the important part is that we're going on an adventure to murder stuff. And get loot. I mean, really, murder, loot, what more can you ask for? Besides a full set of iron armor? See, now I'm just hoping that, like, the ancient temple or something, or one of those other areas has a uh, nice enchanting table. Because that would just be great. Alright, let's go. Let's see what's up here. Spawners. You'll die fast with this. Crap of lays. What's up here, too? This was the part I was more curious about. Oh, and this looks like Intersection 3. Whoa. This is, um... Intersection 3. The, oh, it's supposed to be like a Fabergé egg. Okay, that makes... That makes sense. I was thinking this is very, like... I don't know. I was thinking, like, flamboyant 70s disco kind of thing. Does it have a bottom? It does. Huh. That's... Cool. Cool concept for intersection. I would never have thought of this. Yeah, Into the Fire, Starlight Jungle, and The Amazing Pink. Okay, I gotta... I, I know I was saying I gotta get the wool, but I need to check this area out. No. Woo! Yes! Oh my god! Oh my god, this is a, this area is amazing. I don't know what the hell did I just kill? I I genuinely have no idea what I'm fighting. Are these zombies? Yeah, I think they're just zombies. Okay. Oh my god, fireworks! That 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 was amazing. I think I'm gonna like this area. Okay. Anyway, let's get back to the molten mines. Great. Sorry, that's just... Oh my god. That was amazing. I guess it was called the Amazing Pink. So, I should I should have expected it, really. But I didn't. I don't know why. And... Pop. Alright, so I'm pretty sure that's this entire route of the map, I guess, clear. Can I put torches here? I can. Oh, why didn't I think of that before? Okay. So this side is clear. Let's head on the other route and get the wool. <laughs> I, uh, I'm sorry, firework. Whoa, 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 no. It, oh my god. It, okay, I, I, in, input lag. Almost just ran off the edge there. Ooh, that, that freaked me out. Right, and there was this spot over there, and there was a blaze spawner down there. Alright. I think for now I'm just going to ignore that blaze spawner and just blitz in. Go into that little tunnel there. Not too worried about that creeper. And yeah, everything remains. Okay, although now this is... Enough, not what I was expecting, that I'm going to have to go back and look at the sign in a moment. Oh, you're not dead. Is this like my- oh, it's probably like Miner's Dormitory or something, I'm guessing. Just because I see uh, those look kind of like little cafeteria tables or something. Yep, crew quarters. And regular zombies. Those can go. Check my settings, okay, yeah. I'm just getting a little bit of lag, so. It's probably just a new area I haven't been really now that I think about it, but. Still worth checking to make sure nothing got cranked up. Alright. 
Right about. Whoa, God. No, oh, right. Why, why are you lagging, game? Why would you do that to me? You know I don't like it. I'm a kid and I don't care how much it lags, I'm still just, what, like, still friggin' happy over the amazing pink. That was fantastic. Oh, I'm sure that didn't help the lag now. <laughs> oh, that was dumb. Let's introduce water! So that the game has to do fluid physics. Yay! Uh huh. <laughs> uh, spiders. All right. Let's get a few torches in here. Kill you, and you, and you, and you, and you, and you. <laughs> oh god, stop lagging, game. And yeah, I, I, I saw the spawn over there. I just felt it was more important to get some torches down first. Let's take this out now. Oop. And you're on fire, and... Are they in, are they just, is there just spawners in every corner? And I, no, there's one up there, but I think I let that. Hat trap chest, nope, not, not, not going into that unsecured. Alright. Little crap. Regular zombie. Your special one. See, and I know they're all trap chests, but that basically says to me that he's trying... Oh, hey, another heavy axe. Nice. But this basically says to me that he's trying to get us to, you know, lure us into a false sense of security. So that way one of them will actually be trapped. Cool. And more balls of crap. Oh, well. Anything in the furnaces? Ooh. Yeah, why not? I'm, I'm feeling greedy. Alright, game seems to be moving better now, I, th I say, as it lags. <laughs> yeah, I should just enter Pearl with a wall. Oh well. Whoa, knocked you up somehow. Nice. Or that's probably why, because all the mobs in the game are right here. Okay. So, uh, yeah, that's a lot of mobs. Oh, did I just break a torch? I did. No. Bad zombie. Okay. 
here. That was dumb, that was dumb, that was dumb. Okay, nothing exploded. Everything is fine. Alright, so. First off, we got an anvil. That's safe. We got another... F Whoa. Okay, let's drop some of the uh, useless junk off. It's the issue with using the uh, looting three sword. Two more Berserker Brews. One of those. And a Lucky Pick. Awesome. Let's consolidate those for this room. With this trap chest. Like I said, false sense of security. One of these is going to be trapped. I know it. Another thin tunic. More cooked pork chops and a spider. Because I now see there's a spawner oven that is up and right in that ceiling. There we go. And da 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 da! A record, which I can't pick up. There we go. Alright, we got weight. Anyway, I think that's going to be it for this episode. We did. We haven't got the wool yet, but we found Intersection 3 and got another music disc. So, this has been Caladoon playing Depths of Urkala. I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, uh, please leave a like or subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.